I brought something that I think would be pretty popular here in Vegas. It is a Roman erotic tessera. It's a brothel token from ancient Rome. I don't know why you would say we did this in Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here today to sell my ancient Roman brothel token. I buy and sell coins and I come across odd things like this and I bought it because I thought it was a good value to resell it. Brothel tokens aren't something that I collect. <laughs> This is, you know, right around, you know, 180. About the time of Christ, Tiberius Augustus, right about in there. Most people really don't think of Rome the way it really was. It was a really highly advanced society. Literally 2,000 years ago, they had sewer systems that weren't matched until the 20th century. And they actually had brothels, and the very large ones would have brothel coins. It was sure. um, basically the way the system was. Brothels had bars, all this other stuff. They had girls that worked upstairs. And if you wanted to go see one of the girls upstairs, you would literally go to the counter and you would pay your money. And when he went upstairs to see his girl, he would go to booth five. <laughs> right. Um, and that way the girl would take the money. And then they knew that there would be no accounting issues. It was a way to make sure that the girls didn't steal the money from management. So, where'd you get it? <laughs> well, I've been dealing in foreign and ancient coins most of my life, and it's...